Hi, this is Daryl Cross from Rainmaker Fitness, and today we're going to get something out of the way. The proper way to do a burpee. Now, I have been doing exercise forever, and I have never heard of the term burpee more than about five, six years ago. So if anybody knows where that came from, please let me know. But you can't go to any class nowadays without doing these. And I see people doing them wrong all the time. Sometimes just because of lack of knowledge. Sometimes it's bad technique. Sometimes a little bit of cheating. But we're going to go through this real quick here because it's a fantastic overall exercise. First of all, there's a series of movements here. I'm going to turn sideways here and try to stay in camera view. The first move is a squat, down to a plank, push up, back to a squat, straight up and jump. These are all one big fluid motion, all of these together, but think about them as those different parts and do each one correctly. Demonstration of a correct one. Now, note, I am standing in the exact same spot I started. I have a little rubber band on the floor that you probably can't see that gives me a bit of a guide, but it shows where my feet stop and start, come back to, straight up, etc. All same spot. So it is down, back, push up, feet to the same spot, straight up in the air. What I see people doing wrong a lot of times is these kind of half motions, which is not great for the knees or the shoulders or the wrists or any of it. They'll go down, they'll already start like this, they'll come down, their feet will come up this way. They'll get themselves back up and then jump straight up, or variations of all of that. But think about it, a squat, a plank, a push-up, back to a squat, a straight-up vertical leap. If you do them quickly, you should be able to get them in a few fluid motions. Simple. It actually is easier to do it that way. One last thing I'll say, as I catch my breath, because this takes a lot out of you, is to think about the last movement from the plank push-up as a crunch movement, not dragging your legs back. Think about using your abs. So I'm going to go down and hold, and we'll go down, we're planking, push-up. Now, from this point on, it is a crunch to here. Not just to bring my legs up, when I'm actually bringing my knees into my chest, the closer the better, and it's straight up. So we kind of just added another movement. Squat, plank, push up, crunch, squat up, jump straight up. Those are burpees, plain and simple. If you use my programs, you're gonna do a lot of them. They make you really tired. They're great for burning calories. There is no muscle in the body that's not used when you're doing them. Do burpees. They're good for you. This is Daryl Cross with Rainmaker Fitness. Let's get better.